going on everyone? It's Sean here and I'm back today to give you guys an early look at the Air Jordan 1 Gatorade in the Rush Violet colorway. These are set to drop December 26th for a US retail price of $175 and a retail price here in Canada of $235. So this shoe is part of the Gatorade 1 collection that's releasing alongside a Cyber colorway, a Blue Lagoon colorway, and an Orange Peel colorway. So here locally in Toronto, these will be available at the boutique level stores like Capsule and Livestock, and they'll also be available at big box retailers such as Foot Locker, Foot Action, and Chance. And before we go on with the review, I want to give a huge thank you to Jordan Brand and The Jump for hooking me up with this shoe early. So these Jordan 1s comes in the special edition box that has both branding from Gatorade and Nike. So this box is done in all orange and it has a matte finish to it and a rougher texture than your normal Jordan 1 box. At the top, we have Mike written alongside this Gatorade lightning bolt, and then on the sides of the box, we have this Nike and swoosh branding. Taking a look at the inside, once you take off the lid, so the inside of the lid is done in this glossy finish, and it says, Be Like Mike. And then inside the box, we have this Gatorade and Jumpman towel that's unique to both the Jordan 1s and the Jordan 6s that I reviewed a few days earlier. So these Jordans are done in your classic and standard Air Jordan 1 high silhouette. Basically, the entire shoe is done in this rush violet color, and the leather on these shoes was surprisingly very good quality. If you guys own or have seen a pair of the original Shattered Backboard ones, the quality on these is not too far behind. Take a look at the toe box, we have this tumbled leather with these perforations found throughout the toe. This tumbled leather extends across the shoe, including the Nike swoosh that's found on the midfoot of both the lateral side and the medial side. Around the ankle collar area on the lateral side, we have this Jordan Wings logo debossed from the leather. We also have a small Gatorade lightning bolt done in orange found on the lateral edge of the back heel. The tongue on these shoes is done in nylon in this brush violet color. The laces on these are done in a flat style also in this brush violet color, but they do come with orange lace tips. At the very top of the tongue, we have this strip of orange leather with Nike Air debossed on it. And then taking a look at the back side of this leather, we have the words Be Like Mike written in white. In terms of laces, there's also two additional colors of laces that comes with the shoes. So we have an orange pair with orange lace tips and a white pair also with orange lace tips. In addition, these shoes comes with this hang tag, then an orange that has the Jordan Wings logo on one side and the Gatorade logo on the other. The inner liner of the shoe is done in brush violet and the insoles on these shoes is done in green with the Gatorade logo on the left insole and the Nike Air logo on the right. These shoes sit atop this violet midsole and then taking a look at the bottom, we have this translucent rubber, also done in purple, but we have this Gatorade logo found underneath. In terms of sizing, I feel like these fit the same to me as all my other Jordan 1s, so I'd recommend just sticking with your normal true size. To give you guys a quick point of reference, I consider my true size to be a 10.5, but I normally wear between a 10 and a 10.5 in most Nike sneakers. And I also wear a 10.5 in other models like the Jordan 3 and the Jordan 10. On the other hand, I find that a lot of Jordans fit kind of big, and as a result, I have to go a half size down. So examples of some Jordans that I go a half size down in are the Jordan 2, the Jordan 5, the Jordan 6, the Jordan 11, and the Jordan 12. Comfort wise, so these fit and feel the same to me as all my other Jordan 1s, so I wouldn't say that they're extremely comfortable, but they give you a very nice stable feeling on feet, and they're gonna feel like your average everyday kind of sneaker. Now let me lace up these Gatorade ones and show you guys how these look on feet. Overall, to be completely honest, when I first saw pictures of the four colorways of the Gatorade ones, these purples were at the bottom of my list. But since then, I've been able to see more pictures and see some of these in person, and my ranking has kind of changed. So at the top of my list, I like the Cyber colorway, which is the Lemon Lime one. And then second, I'd say is the Orange. Third one would be these, and then fourth one would be the Blue Lagoons. 
at the end of the day though, it's really up to you guys. So I think that the lemon lime is really, really dope, but it's gonna be really hard to wear. But this one's probably gonna be the safest bet and the easiest to wear with just your everyday fits. So let me know in the comments down below, which is your favorite of the Gatorade One Pack. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to give me that thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already and give me a follow also on my Instagram as well at SGO8. One final thank you goes out to Jordan Brand and The Jump for hooking me up with this shoe early. And if you guys are planning to grab this, once again, these drop December 26th for 175 US or 235 Canadian dollars. So until next time, thank you guys so much for tuning in and I'll catch you guys in my next review.